Hello guys, my name is Fruity and today I got a pretty awesome video for you. I've been grinding it out seriously hard on the Vanguard Rock playlist and I thought, well, why not record it and see what sort of loot I get? It's sort of an RNG test type thing. So I've done 50 strikes on the Rock playlist, that's the Dark Below one, and it didn't work out too well at first. It worked out a lot better in the end, so I noted it all down in a notepad, so I'm just going to look at it now and tell you exactly what happened. So in total, I got 6 legendaries, 96 blues, and 2 ships. Now the legendaries came like this, on my 7th strike, my 13th strike, my 18th strike, and then for you people who get really annoyed when you don't get any loot, you're going to love this. I went dry for 27 strikes, no legendaries for over half of that 50, which is just insane. But then... R and Jesus must have just been like reborn or something because on my 46th strike I got a legendary, on my 48th strike I got a legendary, and then finally on my 49th strike I got another legendary. So pretty much three back to back legendaries at the end after I thought it was going to be a failure. So let's head back down to the tower and let's check out everything we've got. So if you take a look at my inventory, every single slot is full. Just, it's insane. I didn't think I'd get that many. And then we'll go in the vault as well. In here, I've got even more. Look at all of those. It's madness. It's absolute madness how many I've got. And there's another four there. Ignore those. I'm saving those until the dark below. So, obviously, you've probably come to this video because you want to see me opening them. So we're going to get right into that. And just a quick disclaimer here. I'm saving my legendaries until the um, House of Wolves DLC comes out. So don't expect me to open those. But what's an opening video without opening some legendaries? So there's one thing that I can still gain from these engrams, and that is Galahorn. So I have two heavy weapon engrams, one of them wasn't from doing this whole playlist thing, another one was from um, the weekly heroic strike. So I'm going to open those at the end, but right now I'm just going to spam open all of these blues for you. I don't know why I closed that, I just sent that was my pad. So we're going to start off with um, probably the less interesting ones, we'll do all the armor first and then we'll do the weapons. I don't know how many I've got exactly, but it must be nine of each surely. So we've got some motes of lights. I have also kept note of all my motes of lights and strange coins for you so you know how many you'll get when doing the playlist. No legendaries so far, we've probably opened over 20 already. And this is also going to equate to over 3 crypt arc levels I believe, which is just incredible. There's a strange coin. Still no legendaries though. Oh there's one, Titan Helmet, Object 959. So obviously I can't use that, I don't even have a Titan. I've got two Hunters and the Warlock. Oh there's another one, some uh, Hunter Boots. I've got full ray gear, so they're not a use to me. I'll just uh, dismantle them. A moat of light, that's good. Strange coin. And don't want to click on that legendary just yet. Another moat of light. Genghis E. No, nope. all this is just terrible. It definitely seems like uh, strange coins are rarer than the moats of light. Oh, whoop, shit. Thunderlord? What? <laughs> I was going to save that till the end, but okay. Thunderlord, whatever. I don't think uh, Zer has even sold that in the whole time this game has been out yet, so I won't say no to that. There you go. There's an exotic reward from doing 50 strikes. I got Thunderlord, bitch. So we're going to move on. We're going to open these ones now. I don't want to open the primary ones because I really want some new primaries for when um, the DLC drops. I've got another three on my other character, so I've got five of them in total, which is just madness. And now we just have the snipers left, and then uh, I'm going to dismantle everything, and we'll get the other ones out of the vault and open those two. Okay, that's all of those. Let's just quickly check how many motes of lights and strange coins I got. So I've got 13 motes. Some of those are from like leveling up and rewards at the end of the playlist as well. And three strange coins, so you didn't get anywhere near as many of those. So I'm going to dismantle all these blues now and I'll get right back to you once I've done that. Okay, we're back. So I've dismantled all those blues now and pulled out another 30 odd from the vault and from also in the Postmaster. So we're going to head over and open all of those now and see if we get any more legendaries from them. Oh, these are also all of the uh, Glimmer things that I got from doing the Strike playlist. So I got 8 keys, 10 banners, 5 codex, and 12 beads. So at 200 each, that's a fair amount of Glimmer. Obviously, it's not as good as doing some sort of uh, loot cave or something, but I hate the loot cave. I don't understand why people would do that. Just play the game how it's supposed to be played, really. So let's just spam open all of these and see if we get anything. There's a Moat of Light. Anything else? No? Just going to give me all these blues. Another motor light, strange coin. Oh, coiled hiss. That looks like a pulse rifle to me. 
don't use pulse rifles. They're going to improve their damage. They're going to put them up 6% more damage, but I don't think that's going to be enough. Radar stays active. That's not bad. And aiming this weapon increases effective range. So in total from the blues, we got one legendary primary, a legendary helmet and legendary boots. Now I opened one of my legendaries and it gave me Thunderlord, but I've still got one more legendary heavy machine gun that I'm going to open for you guys. So I'm going to be right back, I'm going to get it from my other character and then we're going to see what we get inside it. Alright guys, I am back in the tower and let's just hope RNG has given me a blessing. I've already got the Thunderlord, that was amazing, I didn't see that coming, it, when it popped up I was like, hey, what? So uh, the one thing that I want from the heavy weapon engram is obviously Galahorn. Now if you take a look here, I have 9 legendaries, ignore the exotics, they don't really mean anything, for now at least. I'm saving all of these until the House of Wolves comes out, because in theory, hopefully they'll give me new House of Wolves stuff. But we're going to open this one, the heavy weapon one, because I really want Galahorn. Like, that's the only thing that I can gain from these engrams now. I've got everything else. And I just want to show you the Postmaster as well. Look at that. Five Crypt Dark packages I have now. Three new mo four new Monarchy and a Vanguard. Also saving those for the House of Wolves too. Um, I'm going to do a mass opening of everything I've got here. Once the DLC drops, I'm going to save up absolutely everything I have. Hopefully my vault is going to end up being filled with like 20 legendaries or something. I think that would be awesome. So we're going to go straight into this guy, and I'm going to open it now. Here we go, fingers crossed. Come on, Galahorn. Three, two, one. Yay! One-way ticket, exactly what I wanted. Thank you, Iron Jesus. I love you. So, yeah, that's pretty much everything. I should also mention what other players got, because I know people hate it when other players get legendaries and not them. So, in total, all the players I went with got six legendaries, three ships, and one person got an exotic, which was Universal Remote. So I wasn't really bothered about that. But most of that came in that 27 strikes dry spot, which was just... I can't believe how long it went dry for. That was over half of the whole thing. So yeah, that's pretty much this done. This test obviously isn't enough. 50 strikes for something this random. I have to do more. So maybe every two weeks, maybe every one week. It depends how much I play Destiny. We'll see. Hopefully this video gets a response, maybe like 10 likes or something, because most of the, my videos only get like 4. Yeah, uh, this has been Fruity. Thank you very much for watching. I will always continue to try and improve these. I know I'm far from the best at doing YouTube and stuff, but I really appreciate the support I've had so far. So I will see you next time. Peace.